I don't actually know the words, you guys. I'ma just be singing though. Hi. Hello. I'm Bon Bon, nice to meet you. Hey everybody, welcome back. Um I was I was gone on Tuesday, but I'm back. And you know, I realize I don't think on this channel that I have spent some time with my first love. And that is Hui Sung. I know. I excuse me. I stopped by seven. I stopped by Boa. I even stopped by uh, uh, Danny at one time. But I did not stop by Hui Sung. I, I, I'm fired. I can't believe it. So that is what we are doing today. We are going to get into Hui Sung's With Me. Now, this is one of my first ever K-pop songs, okay? I'm pretty sure it was, uh, it was seven, um, what was it? <laughs> One more time. That's what the song is called. I keep telling y'all, I never knew what the song was called for real. It was just, um, you don't have to be alone to me, but the song is actually called One More Time. So when we was watching the music video thing, um, I don't even remember the host name. Sorry to those men. But Seven came on and then I'm pretty sure Hui Sung was on the same. So these are like, within the same day of each other. These are my first K-pop songs. So what we gonna do is we're gonna get into the music video first. And I'm looking at it right now and it looks so old, you guys. I wish somebody would remaster it. I do, it's all pixelated. So we're gonna do that. And then I'm gonna see if I can find the lyrics too because I desperately wanna know what he's talking about this song. I heard that Hui Sung is who you put on when you want a sad girl moment, okay? Um, he's he's very he's very emotional, so um, very excited to see what that's about. Now, when it comes to my Etsy shop, you guys, it's almost ready. I'm preparing everything that I'm needing to prepare, and you know what? Spooky season is right around the corner, so I'm probably gonna go ahead and get some spooky things going too. Might even get them up early, you know. Autumn feels is in the air. I'm ready to usher summer right on out. It is too hot. So keep an eye on my shop, you guys. Get your last minute things because I'm gonna be switching everything out. Oh, it's so small, you guys. Oh, oh. This song's dedicated to all the- Oh, that is my baby. That is my baby. Real slow. Real slow. Are you ready for shock? This whole chick I'm not born in the now, John Bell. The mock so either in the door. I don't actually know the words, you guys. I'm gonna just be singing though. Will she go and call? Just a side note, me and my cousins always thought he was saying mi corazon and he's not so uh, I was surprised by that. That's just a little tidbit. Sister, me too. 
You guys, can she see? Can can she see? Cause I always thought that maybe she's blind a little bit because she she seems to get frustrated very easily if she's looking at something or maybe her vision's like kind of blurry or whatever. And she don't really seem to be looking at anything in particular too tough, you know. She's not like dialed in. And then at the end, she kind of I, I don't know. Y'all let me know. Y'all thought I was gonna try to hit that note and embarrass myself? Mm -mm. See, this part right here, you guys, I was just never quite sure if she's like looking at anybody in particular. Like she don't even look back or not, she just, you know? Like who is she to him? I'm so confused about this ending. Well, wasn't that just something? I'm just, I'm, listen, I don't actually know the words. I was just singing the words as how I thought they were saying them back in the day. And you know, despite the fact that I am actively learning Korean, like yes, I actually am taking classes, thank you. I'm finally learning. My dream is being realized. I also realize that it's very hard to deprogram yourself once you think you know the words to a song and you sing it the way that you sing it. And then when you find out that's not what they're actually saying, it's very hard to like read and go and do what they're actually saying you know but i do realize that there were some words that actually were the words probably maybe and that i do recognize uh some of them but uh that that's that's what that was so now i'm gonna see if i can find a version of the lyrics because i just i need this for me at this point okay 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 This song's dedicated to, to the broken hearted. Yes. Okay. Okay. That should have been my indication. Sure. Real slow. Real slow. Are you ready for a shock? A shock. Okay. Now join them. So we know join them. Don't join them. No. Wait. Why do you ask me to leave without asking my heart? When on name I'll move. Oh, I thought he, you guys, I thought he was saying, well, I made my move. Fascinating, let's keep going. <laughs> attention to the lyrics girl 
Even if you hate me, I can love you. I can be happy to love you. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. See, because my problem is I'm trying to look at the Korean lyrics so I can see what he's actually saying so I can have the potential to sing the song right one day whilst also trying to look at the English lyrics and understand what's actually being said, which means that my eyes are doing this, which means that I'm actually retaining none of it. So I'm going to go ahead and keep trying to focus for real. Okay. you guys my camera cut off at the end there so like the last couple seconds of the song is lost to oblivion I know my camera really just be holding me like that I don't know what it'd be like oh I can only record for like 20 minutes at a time before I'm just gonna cut off and then you'll look over and notice that I'm not recording anymore like it's just but yes okay we've done it we've done it and um I just have a question was Teddy busy that day? Like he couldn't come in and do the recording? Was he out of town? Was he, you know, otherwise accounted for? Like I just, it would have been great if both of them were in the music video because then I really would have had a meltdown. Like I truly, like the dude that they got was fine, okay? Like he did his little part and it's it's cool. No shade to, to the homie, but um, having Teddy just really would have really would have been something special like let me tell you guys something okay I no no this is Hui Sung's music video so what we're gonna do is stand Hui Sung I almost did something absolutely unforgivable and to my husband I am so sorry sir because you were my first love and that is what we're gonna focus on today you guys I just knew I knew you actually couldn't tell me that I wasn't gonna marry Hui Sung you couldn't you actually couldn't do it because I just knew I had his pictures in my locker let me tell you something middle school I had Hui Sung seven one time and I think Xinhua in my locker um along with uh crisscross yes i did i yeah <laughs> and so i'm just i'm glad 
that I was able to take this time to see what this song was actually talking about. And he's, he's very sad. Oh my gosh, I understand your painful heart. Yeah. And so now that means I'm gonna have to go down the road to look at his other songs that I'm super duper in love with still to this very day. And um, how's he doing, you guys? Do you know? I haven't heard a peep about him in years. I don't know if he just left the music scene or what have you. Um, so if he's if he's doing fine, then I love that for him. If he said that and I sang and I didn't, I did it and I proved what I needed to prove, and now I'm done with it, then that's great, baby. And I'm so happy for you. So I just hope that you are somewhere living in bliss, and harmony, and not stressing. So if you love this song like I do, let me know down in the comments down below, and I will see you all in Perfect Twenty Five.